Madison De La Garza played the defiant, often hilarious Juanita Solis on Desperate Housewives for four years. But since then, she's gone on to do plenty more, including more acting, voiceover work, speaking out against bullying, taking up aerial gymnastics, and becoming a budding YouTube star. Here's a look at what Eva Longoria's precocious TV daughter has been up to since she left Wisteria Lane. Good Times as Desperate Housewives was coming to an end in 2012, De La Garza recounted in an interview with My San Antonio what a great experience the show was, especially her relationships with her on-screen mom and dad, Eva Longoria and Ricardo Chavita. Being a celebrity in her own right, though, took some getting used to. People would walk up to me and ask, are you that girl in Desperate Housewives? It freaked me out at first. Now I know how lucky I am to have people recognize me like that. It makes me feel warm and fuzzy. The Bonds of Sisterhood Though there's a nine-year age gap between Madison De La Garza and her half-sister Demi Lovato, the two couldn't be closer. Over the years, De La Garza and Lovato have shared the stage, the screen, and the fight against online bullies. In a 2015 interview with Seventeen, De La Garza talked about a time when Lovato came to her defense. I got a ton of negative comments after I posted a Vine on Twitter where I was cooking with Demi. People made fun of me, saying I had a hunchback. Demi freaked and direct messaged people to yell at them, and she tweeted at her followers to stand up for me. The support goes both ways. Lovato told Access Hollywood that it was during an intervention that her mom told her, you know, we're going to move back to Texas and you're not going to be able to be around your little sister. Just the idea of not being around De La Garza was enough to motivate Lovato to overcome her drug and alcohol addictions. She was cyberbullied. Unfortunately, the Vine incident wasn't the only time De La Garza was a victim of online bullies. In an essay for Latina, she revealed that as young as age six, she was, quote, being called fat, ugly, and slut on Twitter. Naturally, De La Garza was deeply affected by it. She wrote, Their opinions turned into my insecurity, and suddenly I was aware of every meal, every outfit, every post on social media. However, every day it gets easier to accept myself for me instead of the labels they had put on me. Reading all the mean comments online is not gonna hurt forever. Um, that's one thing I've learned. Flying high. What exactly is aerial gymnastics? Good question. Basically, it's that Cirque du Soleil stuff where people flip around on big drapes hanging from the ceiling, all while somehow not barfing everywhere. It's pretty impressive, and De La Garza definitely loves it. I just have a passion for it. It's so fun, and it's a great workout. And number two, it's awesome! <laughs> Strong social media game With over half a million followers on both her Twitter and Instagram pages, De La Garza has cultivated her stardom into a loyal fan base. Like any teen, her pages are filled with selfies and group photos with friends, but De La Garza also uses her platform to promote causes she supports, like the National Alliance on Mental Illness and the Suicide Prevention Lifeline. Surprisingly, she doesn't seem to have an official Facebook page, so either kids are too cool for that now, or she reads all of her grumpy older relatives' political gripes elsewhere. She has her own YouTube channel. After Desperate Housewives, De La Garza moved on to television roles on Bad Teacher and Muertunes, a cartoon that takes place in a world where every day is the Day of the Dead. But she's also staked a claim in the emerging world of new media. She relaunched her YouTube channel where she declares aspirations in many fields including acting, directing, producing, and writing, as well as doing special effects makeup. Since I want them to look super deep, I'm gonna go in with like a black color to create dimension. No, that looks super deep. And she even wrote a short film called The Imbalancing Act, which is pretty impressive for anyone, much less a teenager. With both her TV family and her real family backing her, there's no telling just what she'll end up achieving. Thanks for watching! Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.